Year two, baby. All right, so I moved in. Why am I out of breath? I don't know. So I moved in here about five days ago, six, six or five or six days ago. Moved back into DePaul, into a fraternity this time. No longer in the dorms. Got a decent sized room compared to last year. Back on the college routine, starting practice, starting school. It's a little different than in the summer when I could just shoot whatever I wanted. So might as well start out this year, same way we started out last year, with a dorm tour. Well, it's a room, but I don't know. Enjoy. Welcome to the crib. So probably the main feature of this new room is this nice, wonderful leather couch. And a fun fact about it, it reclines. Oh, yeah. Now over here on my side of the room, we have my desk. Now obviously my desk is where I can do my homework and all that stuff, but more importantly, it's where I can shoot my videos. I can shoot a lot of videos here, so be expecting a lot. Since I moved in yesterday, I'm still rearranging a few things, so right now you guys are sitting on a goldfish box. But we'll get all set up and We'll be cooking out some videos coming up soon, trust me. Obviously I came prepared with the essential goods, 41 ounces of Skittles, the cool light I talked about in the last video, another light, a calendar that I'll hopefully use at some point in my life, and of course, the business cards. Boom, bada bing, bada boom. Like and subscribe. Now the view from the reclining couch is pretty nice. We got the TV set up here, the Xbox, a movie, a baseball bat that was here when we got here. Saturdays are for the boys. That thingy. So yeah, overall good little main attraction, main setup here. Over on my roommate's side of the room, we got the, another couch. Boom, boom. We got another TV. Another one. And a few more posters. We got the mini fridge over here. Locked and loaded with the good stuff. A lot of Mountain Dew. Sitting pretty there. Got some snacks. Decent amount of closet space. Which is nice. Clothes, more clothes. Clothes, clothes, clothes. So yeah, pretty decent sized room. Hope you guys enjoyed this quick little dorm tour. Now back to Old Wyatt or Future. Old white for you guys, future white for me, because I haven't recorded that part yet. But yeah, enjoy him. He sounds cool. All right, yeah, so that's what we're living with. Um, as you can see the setup here, I'm at the desk. I got this right above me, which is awesome. I love it. Honestly, not a terrible setup for YouTube and everything, so should be good to go on that front. But yeah, so I asked you guys to ask me some questions. Same thing, I, I did this before. I asked you guys to ask me questions about college about fraternity about life about literally anything so let's answer them what's the best part of going to this school um that's tough there's a lot of good things i just one thing for me i really like here is the campus size so like it's a small school like there's not a lot of people compared to like the bigger state schools but the campus doesn't feel like a small school it's kind of spread out so it's like you don't feel like you're at in a very small school, which is nice. It's good to kind of not feel like you're just confined to a small area, which is something I really like about this campus. So yeah, next up, do you have a girlfriend? Um, no, thank you for asking. Thank you for reminding me. Bang, kill, Mary, Selena Gomez, Ariana Grande, and Victoria Justice. Um, I don't wanna kill any of them. All right, we respect women on this channel, so I'm just gonna choose who I marry. Um, I would marry Selena Gomez. What is your life motto? So, I've told a few people this. My one motto, the one rule that I think can just sum up all rules, all laws, all obligations as humans. Drum roll, please. Don't be stupid. It's easy. If you think about it, literally, any rule, any law that you've ever been told can be filed under the giant law of don't be stupid. 
Oh, you want to kill someone? No. Don't be stupid. Oh, you want to steal someone else's stuff? Don't be stupid. Oh, you want to go to Japan and film in a forest that you shouldn't be filming at? Don't be stupid. You want to eat sunscreen? Don't be stupid. Literally everything can fall under, don't be stupid. So that is the life motto that I live by, because if everyone in the world just doesn't be stupid, we're gonna have a lot less problems. So, there's my life advice. How can you look at a baby and name it Gary? <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know if Gary, yeah, that's tough. That's tough. Like a nice newborn baby boy and just call it Gary. I apologize to Gary's out there, but I don't know, man. I don't know how you could do that. What is your favorite activity to do on campus? Well, besides this? No, nope, it's this. Making videos for you guys. Vikings record predictions this season. All right, so I'm gonna be realistic. I've been a little biased in the past when making predictions on how the Vikings will do. I genuinely think we can win the division. I don't think it's going to be easy, but I think I think 11 wins can win the division. So I'll put us at 11 and five and winning the NFC North. How are you even a sophomore in college? Also love you and miss you. I know I look like I'm 12. I've made it a point on this channel that I look like I'm 12. I understand I look like I'm 12. So I act like I'm 12 sometimes, but hey, talk to me in like 30 years from now when I look like I'm 21. What's it like being an international superstar? You know, sometimes it's tough, really. Um, I think the best thing for me is just always remember where I came from, keep me grounded a little bit. Um, we really started from the bottom. I mean, we used to only have like 500 subscribers. Now we're like 550 and it just blows my mind how we can just grow so quickly. So really, all credit to you guys. Thank you for getting me to this moment. I wouldn't be anywhere without you guys. So honestly, I owe my credit to you. Stay humble. Best Disney movie, only one correct answer, of course. Duh, I made a video on it. It's Teen Beach Movie, not even close. Any argument you could make for any other movie is just wrong. Objectively, it's wrong. Subjectively, it's wrong. You're wrong. It's Teen Beach Movie. If you could customize one thing in your normal life, what would it be and how would you customize it? If I understand this question correctly, I think I would go weather. And I would make it so the weather I would choose is the weather when it's like just about to rain. It's like the, there's like the five to 10 minute period where you don't know if it's gonna rain. So you're sitting outside like, is it gonna rain? Or is it not? Like you just don't know. That's like my favorite weather ever. Like that little in between, like rain and sunshine. You see the dark clouds, they're there. Like you know a storm could be coming, but then also it could just kind of like fizzle out and just not be anything. If you could be a professional athlete for any sport besides tennis, which sport would it be? Basketball would be sweet because I feel like that's the most like harmless way to be an American icon. Because I feel like football's like like the forefront of American sports right now, but it's just like, I don't want to die. Like that scares me. Look at me, I wouldn't survive. Um, so I think basketball, ideally, if I could be like really good, where like so good that it just came natural, so I didn't have to like work that hard. It sounds bad, but like, come on. So probably basketball. If you could sign a brand deal with one clothing brand, what one? Is Goodwill a clothing brand? I'm gonna choose Goodwill. All right, thank you guys for submitting questions. Honestly, thank you guys for your support. Um, hopefully you're gonna be back on a regular posting schedule soon. Make sure to check out the podcast. I'm shooting a few episodes here soon. And always check out the 9to5.co right here. Boom. Go sign up, log in, do whatever you gotta do. I'm posting there daily. So yeah, keep up with my stuff. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Yeah, dream girl, dreaming, I be dreaming. Missing all the days you got me feeling. I said I love you, baby, you know I mean it. Hey, yeah, dream girl, I be dreaming.